Which animal holds the title of the biggest predator of the seas? Or which is the biggest oceanic carnivore ever? Let's take a look at this list. At number 10 we have the colossal squid. It is sometimes called the Antarctic squid or the giant cranch squid and it is believed to be the largest squid species in terms of mass. The species is confirmed to reach a mass of at least 495 kilograms or almost 1100 pounds. Though the larger specimens, known only from beaks found in sperm whale stomachs, may perhaps weigh as much as 600 to 700 kilograms or 1300 to 1500 pounds, making it the largest known invertebrate. They also measure 10 to 14 meters or 33 to 46 feet in length on average. On the ninth spot, we have the Elasmosaurus. This is a genus of Plesiosaur that lived in North America during the Campanian stage of the late Cretaceous period about 80.5 million years ago, measuring 10.3 meters or 34 feet in length and 2 metric tons uh, in body mass. Elasmosaurus would have had a streamlined body with paddle like limbs, a short tail, a small head, and an extremely long neck. The neck alone was around 7.1 meters or 23 feet long. So it's actually really small compared to others coming up next, but it's still a pretty big beast. Number 8. The Mosasaurus Hoffmanni This is the largest representative of the group of extinct sea reptiles called the Mosasaurus or the lizards of the Meuse River. Well, that's what the name means, the Mosasaurus. They lived around 82 till about 66 million years ago, dying out during the KT extinction event. The Hoffmanni species has had a quite a few size estimates over the years, but the usual range is between 13 to 15 meters or 43 to 50 feet in length. They would have been the apex predators during that time, making brunch out of every fish, reptile and dinosaur or sea creature available on the pantry. Number 7. The Shonisaurus This is a very large species of ichthyosaur which are extinct sea reptiles from the late Carnian stage of the Triassic period more than 230 million years ago. The species called the Shonisaurus popularis measure around 13.7 to 15 meters or 45 to 50 feet in length and weighed around 16 to 30 metric tons in body mass. The Shonisaurus had a very long snout and its flippers were much longer and narrower than in other ichthyosaurs. They were discovered in Nevada out of all places. At number 6 we have the Megalodon. An extinct species of mackerel shark known as the Megalodon or the Big Tooth lived from the early Miocene through the Pliocene epochs between 23 and 2.6 million years ago. According to previous studies, the Megalodon vanished around 2.6 million years ago, coinciding with a wave of marine extinction. Estimates suggest it grew to be between 15 to 18 meters or 50 to 60 feet in length, three times longer than the largest recorded great white shark, and weighing in at around 40 to 50 tons. Number 5. The Liviathan Melville. The Liviathan is an extinct genus of macroraptorial sperm whale containing one known species, the L. Mevillae. The genus name was inspired by the biblical sea monster the Leviathan. The Leviathan's total length has been estimated to be around 14 to 18 meters or 44 to 59 feet long and weighing around 50 to 60 tons, similar to that of a modern sperm whale, making it one of the largest predators known to have existed. It would have coexisted with the Megalodon and maybe would have had many fights, winning some and losing some from time to time depending on both creatures' size, specimen age and maturity. Number 4. The Basilosaurus Although the name means King Lizard, it actually was an early ancestor of modern day whales meaning it is a mammal. It existed from 41 till about 33 million years ago and commonly found in the ancient Tethys Sea. It was one of the largest, if not the largest, animal of the Paleogene. It was the top predator of its environment, preying on sharks, large fish and other marine mammals. The biggest of their genus, the species Cetoides, it is 17 to 20 meters long or 57 to 65 feet in length and weighing up to more than 50 to 60 tons. Number 3. The Shastasaurus this is a very large extinct genus of ichthyosaur from the middle and the late Triassic and it is the largest known marine reptile with specimens found in the United States, Canada and China reaching more than 20 meters or 66 feet in length. The largest however measured about 21 meters or 69 feet and would have weighed in at around 62 to 68 tons. This creature had a distance of 7 meters or 23 feet between the front and the back flippers. Now that's big, oh yeah and they also are specialized hunters.
Number 2. The Sperm Whale This is the largest of the toothed whales and the largest toothed predator today, or maybe ever. It is the only living member of the genus Physeter and one of the three extant species of its family. Major males average are around 16 meters or 52 feet in length, but some may reach more than 21 meters or more than 70 feet with the head representing up to one-third of the animal's length. The bigger ones would also on average weigh between 70 to 80 tons, and these are not estimates since the creature is alive and well today. With some old reports of dead males reaching lengths of over 80 feet and weighing more than 100 tons. And number one, the little stock monster. Okay, so I'm going out on a limb here, and the debate is still out there on the true nature of this creature. But all I'm saying is that the evidences do point out to a very large sea animal close to the size of a blue whale that existed in the Triassic period. It would have been an ichthyosaur and the similar bone fossil that was discovered was around the same type of bone that was seen in the Shastasaurus or the Shonisaurus and it was 25% bigger than any of these species, pointing out to an animal that would have been around 26 meters or 85 feet long and weighing more than 100 tons. If this guy did not exist, then the sperm whale is the winner and the biggest ever. So I hope you have enjoyed watching this video. And with that, we come to the end of it. So do hit that like button for support and subscribe as well. But most of all, smash that bell icon for regular updates and new videos right here on this channel. Till the next one, take care guys.